me take you over to the lake side city of Kisumu where tonight it is emerging that the supply of fish could go down. This is due to the discovery of a fast spreading tilapia lake virus, a disease that affects the liver of the fish and one that can greatly reduce a fish population. The Food and Agriculture Organization that is FAO is holding a 10-day training workshop in Kisumu for fisheries officials and experts from six African countries in a bid to build capacity to tackle the problem. KTN's Kevin Ogutu has been following up on this story and as he explains, there's still no evidence if the virus has any health effects on humans. Tilapia is a fish variety that is widely consumed in Africa. For a long time, Africans relied on natural freshwater bodies like lakes, rivers and streams to obtain it. But because of the increasing demand, many have ventured into fish farming in countries like China, with massive output in terms of cultured tilapia fish, have found market, Kenya being one of the big Chinese tilapia destinations. But not all is well. News of the emergence of a tilapia lake virus has caused panic, a disease that was first discovered in Israel in the year 2009, and up to now, at least 14 countries have reported the discovery of the virus in their tilapia populations. An example closer home being the neighboring Uganda. This particular virus has the potential of really decimating the fish populations in the various ponds compared to when they are free out in the lake in their natural environment. It is against this backdrop that the Food and Agriculture Organization has convened a 10-day workshop at the Kenya Marine and Fisheries Research Institute offices in Kisumu, one that has seen representation from six countries, namely Kenya, Uganda, Ghana, Egypt, Nigeria, and Angola. By the end of this workshop, we should be able to know how to detect tilapia lake virus, what to do in case it is detected, because this is an emerging disease, we don't have the capacity to deal with it. Dr. Melba Reantaso is an aquaculture expert with the UN's Food and Agriculture Organization. We are also aware of um, unexplained mortalities in several countries, but the cause of that unexplained mortalities have not been systematically diagnosed. So whether it's TILV or another bacterial infection or another disease is, we don't know. In Uganda, there are some news that they have spotted the virus. And you know, because we are in one system, um, uh, we, we, we expect to, to be ready for it when it comes in our system. At Luangni Beach in Kisumu, the women in fish business here are now a disturbed lot. Hii ugonjwa inapatikana kwa mtu mwenye amekula ama mwenye ajakula ama ni mvuvi ama tu, wakati tunashika samaki inaweza kuwa ndio inaleta ugonjwa ama samaki ndio iko na ugonjwa. Kevin Ogutu, KTN News. A very scary.